As we've shown elsewhere, most vaccinated people in UK hospitals in the winter of 2021 to 2022 were wrongly classified as unvaccinated, resulting in the false claim that it was only the unvaccinated who were being admitted to hospital ICUs and dying of COVID. Here's how the BBC documentary Unvaccinated exploited that claim. Many ludicrous, unverifiable claims were pushed as facts, including some of which were subsequently revealed in the ridiculous BBC documentary Unvaccinated. Now, I made a formal complaint against the BBC for many of the errors in the programme, but a particularly serious example was this one that's especially pertinent to this discussion. It was in a dramatic interview with Dr Mahul Patel, who's a consultant at the University Hospital Lewisham, and his statement, unchallenged in the programme, was that between December 2021 and January 2022, 20 out of 21 COVID patients admitted to ICU, as 95%, were unvaccinated. And 100% of those who died were unvaccinated. When I finally got a response from the BBC, five months after the original complaint, the complaint editor Jeremy Hayes said, you maintain that the claim was either false, exaggerated or an unbelievable outlier. I've approached the program makers for information about the data which were quoted by Dr Patel. I've been advised that the figures were compiled by Dr Patel himself for the purposes of research. Lewisham and Greenwich Hospital Trust does not record the vaccination status of patients in ICU, so Dr Patel's figures cannot be independently verified. And yet this claim was made unchallenged.